హలో వెల్కమ్ టు పవర్ బి లెర్నింగ్ సిరీస్ వీడియో లెసన్స్ పార్ట్ త్రీ ఇన్ ది సెకండ్ పార్ట్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ వీడియో సిరీస్ యూ మైట్ హ్యావ్ వాచ్ ది డెమో రిక్వైర్ టు క్రియేట్ అ క్యాలెండర్ టేబుల్ యూజింగ్ డాక్స్ ఇఫ్ యూ హ్యావ్ నాట్ వాచ్ దాట్ బెటర్ వాచ్ ద సేమ్ టు అండర్స్టాండ్ ది నీడ్ ఫార్ అ క్యాలెండర్ టేబుల్ ఇన్ దిస్ పార్ట్ యూ విల్ గెట్ అన్ ఐడియా ఆన్ యూజింగ్ ది టెంప్లేట్ టు క్రియేట్ రిపోర్ట్స్ ఫ్రమ్ యువర్ డేటా అలైన్ టు ఇండియన్ ఫైనాన్షియల్ ఇయర్ సిస్టమ్ you can download the template from the link given in the description you will see three tables in the template the table called basic date contains a column called my dates i have created two calendar tables in the names cy and fy in cy months are organized from january to december in fy months are organized from april to march let me now open the power bi template i am talking about as you can see it contains three tables a basic date table with only one column called my dates and the earliest of them is 1st january 2023 and the latest of them is 31st december 2023 and there are two more tables here called cy and the fy you may be interested in knowing how the cy table was created you can see the formula that was used to create this particular calendar table in which i have used the plain calendar auto function whereas if i am talking about the indian financial years for that calendar fy i use the function called calendar auto within brackets i am using the number 3 which means march is going to be the end of a fiscal year you can open the tables in the data view and check the formula that i have used to create these columns both for the cy table as well as for the fy table and you can feel free to make some changes for example you may not be interested in showing all the four digits of an year or you may be interested in just showing fy 2023 something like that feel free to make some changes as and when you need let us now have a look into the model view wherein you will be able to find the basic date table is not related to fy or cy tables you may now ask me a question hi raja then what is the purpose of this table plain and simple for the calendar auto function to populate a series of dates we need at least yet another table with one date column and that is what your basic date table is doing oh if that is the case in case i am loading my own data can i remove the basic date table from the model perfectly correct you can remove that because you have some other table with at least one date column based upon which both the fy and the cy tables will be populating the dates let us assume that i have some data maybe in an excel sheet similar to what you see in the screen now a table called the sales data that holds a column called the order date and then a couple of more tables and if i am going to pull all of them into my power bi i can very well see that these tables are occupying as well as the fy cy basic date tables are also there in the model now as per our previous discussion i may not need this basic date anymore i can select that and i can remove that the next step is if you are interested in creating a report based upon indian financial years you just need to ensure that the date column from the fy table and the order date column from the sales data so i can uh, click on this date column from here and then i can drag it and keep it uh, carefully on order date that is one possible way of creating a connection or i can choose yet another option probably easy for some of us called manage relationship in which i am going to choose a new relationship between my fy tables date column and that of my sales data tables order date column click okay and then you can close this dialog box now you can see an one to many relationship has been created between the fy table and the sales data table this is a kind of star schema in which uh, the existing dimension tables are talking to the fact table or filtering the fact table and similar to that now your fy table is also connected to the sales data as a dimension table so this calendar table can also be called as a date dimension table after creating connection in the model between your fy table and the fact table you can uh, create reports based upon indian financial calendar system that is april to march i will provide a very quick demo on creating a matrix in which i am going to use the column called finnier from my fy table then i would like to create a category wise report for the 
sales value or bill value which is the name of the column in this uh, table so very quickly i have created a report based upon uh, april to march and that is the purpose of uh, this template hi raja wait why don't you provide a demonstration on using your indian financial year calendar to create a time intelligent report such as year over year growth or month over month variance hi debat sure you will see them in part 4 of this series stay tuned